What's up, fellow collectors? Welcome back. Today might be Master Toy Museum. I'll be a curator today. Guys, I'm hanging out down here on a very, very early Friday morning. My cup of coffee. and my fantastic toy collection here at the museum. And we have another fun offering for you today. More oddities, uh, more fantastic hidden treasures here at the MIB Master Toy Museum. Guys, we collect everything, but more importantly, everything that I like. <laughs> Things that you don't, you wouldn't think that I would like. And we have another fun offering from NECA Toys. We're looking at uh, two figures that have been extremely difficult to track down for me. Uh, very hard to track down. Uh, these beautiful figures are from the movie Coraline. Uh, more of a sci-fi fantasy puppet movie from 2009. Um, one of the star voices um, of Coraline was uh, Dakota Fanning. Who's the voice of Coraline? A really cool fantasy type movie. About, a, about a, a little girl that finds a hidden door in her house that puts her into an, a, a similar universe, a reverse universe of her life. But what really got me was the fact that, you know, this that entire movie was, was done with puppets. Uh, nothing CGI... Everything was was handmade. It, it, it was it was very very extraordinary. And NECA Toys came out uh, with these Coraline action figures, if you will. And you can use the word action because, as you can see, Coraline comes with a, a display um, base here. She's a posable puppet with attitude, right? But she has a ton of articulation on her. Beautiful work. And it looks just like Coraline from the movie. So, I mean, whoever did the sculpts did a fantastic job. And we have two here. We have one, uh, Coraline, with the, the yellow rain jacket, raincoat. And we have this is the orange sweater, Coraline with the orange sweater or shirt. I could find one at times, but I couldn't find the other one. And because I wanted both of them as a as a pair, I was always left with that, you know, uh, debate whether or not I should get the one now or get the other one or just leave it until I could find both of them. So I would always leave. Like I found this one a few times at random different stores at targets uh at um uh, bookstores but i couldn't find this one so i will leave this one but i found both of these guys at target at the same time 
And I said, you know what? It's just meant to be. I've actually found both of them together. So I purchased them. This is the stuff that I really enjoy collecting. Uh, things that that really grab me because they're different. I think in my old age of collecting, uh, this is where I'm I'm leaning more towards now. Uh, finding uh, odd collectibles. Things that I, I, I you know, 20 years ago, I, I, I wouldn't have even thought about collecting. But now I find myself really enjoying uh, this aspect of collecting. But this is a, a toy museum that's geared towards historical uh, preservation of all toy lines. And we'll turn this one around. Let you see the back here. Get your blown out look here. Articulated figure in yellow raincoat, and as you can see, she comes with the stand. You can pose her in all types of poses, and here's a cool part uh, function here you can swap out the uh, face plates. You can remove the uh, her face, the front of her face. So you remove and swap her expression, expressive face with faces from other core line articulated fi figures. Fully functioning clothing. Detach her clothing, uh, clothing's hook and loop fasteners to assess the internal armature. Explore her unlimited range of heroic po he heroic poses to create an impressive display. A dynamic stand, figure stand, secure core line to the stand with built-in body attachment points, a quick release extension arm and clasp, or the freestanding foot pegs. Yeah, so this one has foot pegs on it. The other one don't, doesn't. Cloth, as uh, her, like socks or shoes are more cloth like. But fantastic. Um, this is what you get. NECA really has such a vast and wide range of characters and action figures from all different genres. And the, the Coraline uh, toy line is, is no exception. So I, I, just, I just find... It's so cool that NECA really has some, literally has something for everyone. Uh, these are very expensive. You can find these on Big Bad Toy uh, Store's website. Now you can. I, I couldn't find them before, but now, now you can. One's more expensive than the, than the other. And I believe uh, the, just the, the orange sweater shirt here, Coraline figure is a little bit more expensive. I don't know if you consider her a variant or or what, but most would, I guess. But she is more uh more expensive than the yellow raincoat Coraline. So let's let's flip this one around. Blown out, look at that. Same principles. Dynamic figure stand, adjustable arms and legs. Explore her unlimited range of heroic poses to create an impressive display. 
They got her running right there. There's NECA. This is a 2019 release. It hasn't been out very long. A couple years. Guys, this is just another aspect of our diverse collection here at the MIB Master Toy Museum. You can literally find anything here at the museum and that's that's what we want that's what we we promote here at the MIB Master Toy Museum collectors love the close-ups here a rain jacket here he's got that that sheen to it that glossiness that a a raincoat would have like I said I said earlier you could switch out the the face plates here in the front you can see she's got a, a different expression here on this Coraline figure, the orange shirt version, sweater version. Put the jeans on. Love the hair. What's that translucent type? Here, just like in the movie. As you can see, it's not so much as for kids, so ages 14 and up. Guys, your thoughts, your opinions, we want to hear all of that right in the comment section. Right underneath this video, guys. Just hanging out down here in the museum. More fun on the way, guys. You know the routine. God bless. Stay safe. And keep collecting.